Torchy, most people were writing you off in the playoffs, predicting a semi-final uh, between G2 and Na'Vi. What does it feel like to beat them so convincingly in just two maps? Feels great, feels great to play good on, on the stage, you know. Um, I mean, we played versus G2 on Chengdu already on stage, so we know what to expect, kind of. Kind of and uh, we were also really prepared for this game, so I'm just looking forward for tomorrow. You looked a little bit shaky at times during the group stage. How important was it to come here and play like this in front of such a big crowd? Yeah, I think at the end of the group stage we were a little bit shaky, so I think this game gave us a lot of confidence going into tomorrow. But as Navi, I think they are a great team, so yeah, it, like this game was needed for us. Also, uh, winning on Dust 2 was really nice, and um, we showed that the last game maybe was just an off day, you know, um, versus Vitality, so yeah. Uh, on Dust 2, you lost 14 of the, of the 22 opening duels, but it seemed like tactically you just outplayed them in that map. Yeah, I didn't know about that, but it sounds uh, not too good to be honest to lose that many entries. But I think Camille had uh, really, like Shu had uh, really, okay, so Shu had really good calls and uh, he outplayed, uh, outplayed G2 basically. Like he had a really good mid run calls to go along and also reset to B on the good runs and it just worked out and we also did it perfectly so it was amazing. I wanted to ask you about your Mirage pick. Did you want to punish um, G2 for some of the things that they did against Astralis? Was that your, your thinking? Mm, not too much. I think Mirage is one of our best map. I think like we have like 10 wins on it or something like that. We have like a really good um, win ratio on it and uh, we prefer Mirage a lot. So it was just a comfort pick from us and uh, yeah, it was not, not about punishing them or anything. <laughs> and Shuhei was like smiling throughout the, the series. He seemed to be having a good time in making some very good calls. Yeah, we were having a lot of fun. I think uh, when you are on the stage, you, you, you shouldn't get nervous or get, uh, I don't know, you know, focus on the crowd or whatever. Like you have to enjoy this moment to play on the stage, especially here in Cologne. It's not many times you can play on this stage. So it's just a press, uh, yeah. I saw you hugging some people now after the match. Is it your family? Yeah, it's my family and my girlfriend is here. So I'm just happy they, they can see me alive. You're now going to face Navi. Are you looking to get, to get back at them to get some revenge for what happened at EWC? Yeah, I mean, I th as I said before, I think they are a really good team and we really want to beat them. Um, yeah, they also have a Hungarian analyst. So I just always uh, like to play versus them. So. Yeah, I don't know. It will be a great game. You know, Navi is, I think, one of the most constant, uh, consistent team at the moment. They play great CS, so I think it will be a banger game. You are now through to the semi-finals. Considering how you played here in front of a crowd, how far do you think you can, you can go here? Until the end of the catwalk right there in front of the trophy. Perfect. Thank you so much.